Mike, thank you. New at 10, 61 homeless people died last year countywide. That's according to the El Paso County Coroner's Office. And their deaths, the subject of a memorial mass at a Colorado Springs church tonight. News Live's Sam Kramer was there. He's in studio now. And Sam, some believe that number could even be higher. Yeah, well, it's the first time the coroner's office has released a count like this. And those numbers are based off of autopsy data, hence why they believe it could be low. But still, First Congregational Church made a point to remember and honor their lives as members of our community. The congregation that welcomes anyone through its doors did just that Friday night, a memorial mass with touching music as a way to remember the lives of 61 people, all of whom died on the streets of Colorado Springs in El Paso County last year. It's a number that um, makes me feel sad and I, um, I want to know what we can do to help um, to lower that number. Mandy Todd organized the mass titled Walk With Me, a Requiem for the Streets, featuring music that honors the dead. The memorial aligning with the church's mission, lending a hand to those who are less fortunate. This community, First Congregational Church, has made um, that a priority for our giving um, and our mission in the world. Their lasting message through song is to be courteous neighbors. These folks who are in your backyard are your brothers and sisters too. They're all children of God and that we need to work together to make sure that everybody has shelter and affordable housing. So tonight, these walls reflect the energy of those no longer with us, from the harmonic tone of the choir to the symbolic sound of bells, ensuring their spirits ring on forever. Now, El Paso County released its point in time survey this month showing a 13% drop in people living without a place to sleep at night. That's a good sign, but church staff tell me they'll continue to find ways to help these people. As 61 deaths, there's still too many. Always watching out for you, El Paso County. I'm Sam Kramer, News 5.